here we go, another attempt. That's a battery pack on top there. Ryobi's, Black & Decker, Rona, and Mastercraft. 36 volts is my total output times 5, I think. 5 times 36 for a little better oomph. And I changed the sprocket ratio a little bit with what I had anyway. Tightened up the jack shaft a little bit because it was seeming to become a little loose. It's still a little loose. The back tire is a little loose. It's a little cockeyed. But I'm going to take it for a run and see what happens. Anyway, here, let me get you to hold this and film me. Take yeah. our pit. You have to make sure the dog stays up. The <gasps> Aww, aren't Andrea, these wonderful pictures? Andrea. <laughs> okay, we're off. Well, I tried it again. I don't know, man. It's my batteries. These ones I used yesterday anyway, and I never charged them up. I had a couple that were charged up. But there's still some warm spots in here, and I really mucked around. But uh, I haven't done this yet. Mind you, I just used up most of the juice. More to go. Still more to go. Now I'm going to build a sidecar. Okay, I got a man here. Your man on. The wires got roasting hot under my ass, so I, I had to stop. <laughs> and fast, too. But this is it. Give it a ride. Yeah. It won't do me. Yeah. Well, they didn't get hot, I guess, because there's no weight on it. I think my uh, pulley sprocket, my pulleys are, I'm going to have to downsize if I can't get enough batteries to throw it around. But I'm sure with enough batteries, it'll go with a big, huge dude like me. Progress, I guess. Anyway, with the sidecar, it should be able to... Throw me around a lot better than this. Okay, I went for a ride anyway. Now with the with the new ratio and 36 volts, it'll go. But these batteries just died out so fast. Anyway. Hey, how's it going? This is, uh, there's the sprocket. I don't know if you can see this or not. It's a too much else about it. But it takes a few amps to stretch it a bit so I can fit my batteries on there. Run pretty good. So far I've hooked up two.